Hi everybody, David Kino at Base Camp Trading. Sorry. <laughs> uh, today is Friday, uh, February 16th, and we are looking at SMCI. I know a lot of people have been asking me about this trade uh, in my trading room, giving them projections on how high it can go. And it all started last week when we were around 500, 600. I told people to be careful. Uh, this thing uh, looks, I mean, if you look at where it was, you know, easily around 300, it had doubled in price. And I said, you gotta be really careful with this because again, I have referred to this type of trade as a greater fool theory trade. Not that the company is not valuable, not that maybe it has a new partnership or new product or new service or some really explosive growth, but there's really not anything out there that can go from $300 a share to $1,000 a share over the course of five weeks. Basically, you're saying the company's worth triple the amount of money than it was just less than two months ago. So you have to be very, very careful. And what happens is, on a greater fool theory, is the whole key to this trade is the hope, if you buy into it, is that you are not the fool that paid the very, very last price, which actually is uh, 10,000, uh, 1,700, uh, Sorry, $1,078.50 per share. Okay, because since that time, the market has since fallen. And it is falling below, it's right at the 8 day EMA. It's trying to bounce. See, earlier in the morning, fell in the first 30 minutes. Fell in the next hour. Consolidated for two hours. Fell again after lunch. Made a lower low here. And now we're consolidating again possibly even falling into the close. This can get very ugly. Now, this type of stock lures people in to the hopes that they're gonna catch this explosive move. And they don't realize that they're not buying down here, they're buying up here. So in order for them to double their money, this thing has to go basically at 1,800 or 2,000. Now, all of a sudden, the air comes out and you make a complete uh, reversal of uh, this is the high again is 1078 and we are uh, almost $170 uh, lower um, actually uh, no that's 200 I apologize $270 lower from that all-time high so if you bought up here at 10 1078 and it rises up here at 800 you've lost more than 20%, okay, all in one day. And the thing is, a lot of the people that bought this don't actively watch the market every day, and therefore, when they look at it tonight, they're going to put their sell order, and on Tuesday, the market's going to fall again. So just be careful. What you're looking for, really, is potentially a retracement. Uh, I would give you a reasonable shot if we have a 50% retracement to fall down here to roughly $677, I would round that up to $700. So don't be surprised if Tuesday morning it drops another $100. It could all the way fall all the way down to $600 also. These two targets are the ones that I would look at. And don't be surprised if that happens. You have to be careful when those, those type of trades. If it looks too good to be true, sometimes it is. So just be careful. And remember, this is a greater fool theory trade. Just don't be the fool. Okay? Thanks a lot.